Do you start off with Alverta and the TJ Smith on Saturday? Yeah, Alverta's a Group 1 winner in her own right. Uh, she's been to Europe and competed at the top level, but uh, she does run into the super mare, Black Caviar, so it's nice to have her ride in the race, but she'll want to be on again to beat Black Caviar, I would think. Do you treat the races differently when you're up against a superstar like her, or is it just a normal race for you? Look, all I can do is give my ride the best chance it can have is to run as well as it can and um, if that means winning, beautiful. But no, I just treat it like another race and I'll certainly be taking, paying cl close interest and attention to Black Caviar. I'll be interested to see her in the flesh. And, um, you know, but I've got a job to do and that's my job is to make sure Alverta runs as well as she can. So that's what my main focus will be. In the size produce you've got, do you think? Must be confident going into the race given that he won last week at 1400, which is a query for a lot of these two year olds. Yeah, I am um, quite keen on this horse. I, I think he's a horse that's going to be worth following. Um, he's come a long way in a short time. He's taken giant strides. He goes up a long way in class, so it's certainly his biggest test. It's only his third race start, so, you know, he, he's got to do it yet, but he's certainly got the, the writings on the wall for him to be a good horse, and it would be lovely if he could achieve a high-winning high goal like the size of his th third start. And in the derby, you've got King Gladiator. Yeah, well, he snuck under the radar a little bit uh, by Galileo. He's crying out for the mile and a half. Um, I'd like to see a bit more rain around for him. I think if he can get slow or heavy conditions, I think he's honestly the one to beat. But uh, on, on a better surface, he's probably it'll bring him back to the field a bit. But um, it's a decent derby. You've got Jimmy Chu. He's a deserved favourite. But outside of him, I can't see a lot of other real standouts and um, well, I think my guy's peaking at the right time. Outside of those three horses we mentioned that you're riding this Saturday, uh, anything we should be taking note that you're on? Look, I, I was on a horse for Bart called uh, Kim Heaven. I can't take the ride now because it's only got 53 kilos, but um, she's a filly that I've had a high opinion of for a long time. She's only won one race, so again, she's been asked a pretty decent question this weekend. But um, I think she's certainly one to keep an eye on.